also we have of course our big high like I was just saying and it's going to be settling over us and then look at this retreating to the west a little bit but by Sunday Father's Day it's retreating back right over us kind of just hovering right over the southeast and that actually is going to be a good thing sometimes we get that this time of year which really heats us up and makes it feel very steamy and hot and humid of course but it also protects us from tropical systems and you can see there are a couple of spots over in the pacific that might develop soon those would not get anywhere near us or be of course in the atlantic basin but there is that one spot this is just some cloudiness a little trough of low pressure here in the western caribbean and it now has about a medium chance, 40% chance of developing in five days as it hugs the coast of Central America and eventually kind of moves toward Yucatan or maybe just into Mexico in the southern part of Mexico, possibly into the Bay of Campeche briefly. But the big thing for us is going to be that high pressure shunting whatever is here off to the west. And with that big blocking high, it's not going to be able to get anywhere near the United States. The next name on the list, by the way, if you're curious, Bonnie, of course, we've made it through Alex, Tropical Storm Alex already. So if that does develop, and that wouldn't be till about this weekend, it looks like uh, it would be Bonnie. Our next seven days show our rain chances edging up a little bit by Thursday, Friday and Saturday, but still about a 30% chance. So plenty of heat still going in the next seven days. April.